actually don't know if this has worked. It was an experiment for me and we're going to find out together at the same time. What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Sheila here. You're probably here because of the title of this video or you've probably been following the mini aloe vera series. And if you haven't already, just feel free and go check it out. I know what you came here for, but first I want to show you guys how I make my aloe vera lotion. It's super easy, super simple, super quick. It's relevant to this. First, let's make the aloe vera lotion. At this point, if you've watched the first episode of this mini series, you would know that I made two, diff two separate portions of the aloe vera gel and one I've been using for smoothies and what I'm about to show you in a, in a minute but the second I use it as a lotion and the way that I make it as a lotion is super easy again if you've watched the previous video I kind of lightly mixed in some coconut oil and when I mixed it I put it in the can and it separated itself from the aloe vera so that wasn't a good thing because I need them to both mix in order for them to work properly so I like this mix because it actually it's amazing when it's hot in the summer and the summer is coming up so yeah it's going to be amazing also if you have like skin problems it actually really really helps it well it might not work for everyone but I know it does work for me anyway so what I did is just blend it of course at this point it was already frozen because I had kept it in the fridge for a while so what I did was put it under the sun for the coconut oil to melt and after it melted I simply just blended it you can put it in a blender use my hand blender because I didn't feel like washing after that you can see it's all mixed together it's white and milky and when you put it in the fridge it's all firm and like mixed together that's what that and that's what I was going for here so I'm actually going to get some of this and use it on my skin today because why not anyway so that's it that's about it and finally what you guys are here for because i know for me it's really annoying when i open up a youtube video and watch something and then people start talking about something different but this is all part of the series so i'm really sorry for that but last but not least let's talk about the armpits right now i'm wearing my gym bra because it's the easiest thing for me to show you how i actually don't know if this has worked it was an experiment for me and we're going to find out together at the same time one thing i like about healthy living is when you start taking care of your life even if it's just weight loss you start to take note of the little things that could make your life better you start seeing opportunities you start i don't know things just start seeming possible my channel is about food weight loss wellness and like growth general growth and lifestyle and that is what i want to show you guys honestly that's what i want to share so as much as i might share weight loss stuff i would like to show you so much more stuff like lifestyle how to start your own business how to love yourself and because all those things matter when it comes to self-growth and all that stuff oh my god the noise outside is crazy the construction and the sirens for the hospitals i'm really sorry about that anyway all things in life start with self-care because when you care for yourself you know your value you know your worth you know you know what no one can ever take advantage of you basically lately i've been trying to take pictures for my blog for my new products and stuff like that and because i take so many workout videos and pictures of course i'm bound to like especially let me give an example when i'm doing jumping jacks and one of the things i noticed was the darkness in my armpits i used to have it before but it was it didn't bother me so much because uh well it just didn't bother me so much and here it's winter half the year so really you're always covered up so it doesn't really matter it's not like i've grown up here all my life but i'm just putting that out there sometimes these things don't matter but it, it might it comes into play when it matters and for me right now it does matter so i feel like i need to take care of it i know that i can do something to change it then why not do that to make me feel better and make my pictures look better and make better content you know what i mean i figured if i was struggling with this someone else out there might be struggling with this and i just decided to do document the process i went out there and started researching natural ways of how to lighten my armpits my elbows not so much but my knees because my knees are a bit dark i started with the armpits because it's an experiment and yeah one thing you'd be like oh my god now i have to buy all these products but you don't have to buy all these products if you've been watching my channel for a long time you guys know that i'm pro minimalism and i have a video of my minimalistic lifestyle i'm going to leave a link to it above or somewhere on the screen but yeah if you haven't watched it check it out so here it goes today i didn't have fresh lemon so i used lemon concentrate but you can use fresh lemon make sure to take out the seeds because they're really harsh on the skin lemon juice is really nice and is really important for this particular diy because it's a natural bleach and it helps lighten dark areas it also helps as a natural deodorant so it helps with body odor and then baking soda is a very good exfoliate and it also helps to remove damaged skin it also helps to reduce the reduction of melanin that causes the dark areas around your armpits and also helps as a natural deodorant 
and aloe vera is really good for skin healing lightening i don't know if you guys have watched my five day aloe vera challenge i'm going to leave a link to it above i'll leave it here on the screen you can watch it if you want next thing you're going to do is just mix it make sure the consistency is not liquidy because if it's liquidy you don't want this to happen to you when you're trying to apply it it's basically just going to pour all over you make sure it's like a consistent paste put it in your armpits and rub it in a circular motion let it be there for about 15 minutes before you shower or use a wet towel to take it out and that's it so i've been doing this for the past five days as i told you it was an experiment that's why this video really came late and like i said i do not know if this worked but i hope it worked so this is the big reveal you and i are both finding out so the title of this video actually is based on whether it worked or not we are finding out at the same time i'm showing you what it looks like right now this is what it looks like and right next to it is what it looked like before so i hope there is some change like i said i don't know if this worked i'm going to find out when i'm editing this video and now for all my sisters that don't want to get their hands dirty because i know it might be slimy i have a solution for you i think last year i used aloe vera that i bought from amazon which is i think between 95 to 99 percent organic aloe vera it's actually really helpful you don't have to put it in the fridge because the ones i actually made right now you have to keep them in the fridge otherwise aloe vera will go bad but the aloe vera one that you buy on amazon you don't have to keep it in the fridge all you have to do is make the mix and just keep it aside and it will work for you so i'm going to leave the link to the organic aloe vera in the description box down below if you guys don't want to get your hands dirty feel free to check it out also before i forget guys the seven day detox challenge is starting on monday so register now the link to that will be in the description box down below too so i really hope you guys found this video helpful in some way if the results worked and if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel ring the bell right next to it to be notified when i upload a new video as i upload new videos every week i know i keep telling this to people on their weight loss journey but this applies for everyone guys don't all, don't forget to always stay motivated be patient trust the process and as always guys spread the love because everyone in the world needs some love see you guys next time bye